good morning, middle school. Seamus and he, I are here to talk to you today about what's going on. So yesterday, your teachers and all of us at the middle school and all of you at home heard from the governor of Pennsylvania that schools are closed for the rest of this academic year. A lot of us have a lot of different feelings about that, right? And one of the things that we might be feeling is that we might be feeling sad and we might be feeling disappointed. So we wanted to come and talk to you today. Seamus and I wanted to talk to you a little bit about that today, about how we might be feeling and about some of the things that we might be doing or choose to do when we're feeling sad. So I was feeling disappointed that I'm not gonna get to see you guys. So today I put on my very warmest and fuzziest sweatshirt and I've got Seamus here with me. Um, and I thought maybe we would have story time today. I told you two weeks ago that reading is my favorite thing and I read you one of my favorite stories. And so today I'm going to read to you another one of my favorite stories and we're gonna talk about what's going on and we're gonna talk about who we are, right? We are Wall and Paul Pack students, okay? We are a family and we are a community. The book I'm going to read today is You Belong Here by M. H. Clark. The stars belong in the deep night sky and the moon belongs there too. And the winds belong in each place they blow by. And I belong here with you. The whales and the fishes belong in the sea and the waves belong by the shore and the dunes where the grasses belong to be because grasses are what dunes are for. And the trees belong in the wild wood and the deer belong in their shade and the birds belong so safe and good and warm in the nest they have made. And you belong where you love to be. And after each day is through, you will always belong right next to me. And I'll belong next to you. The frogs and the lilies belong in the lake where the water is silver and clear. And the turtles belong in the homes that they make and the sand where the water is near. The otters belong by the banks of the stream and the cattails belong there too. And the carp belong where the water runs green and the shadows all run blue. And you belong right here where you're home and where I hold you close. Of all of the wonders I've ever known, you're the one I love most. The hares belong in the desert air where the rocks are red and gold. And those rocks belong where the comets out there, which flash bright when the night turns cold. The foxes belong in the high canyon hills and the sage belongs in the sun. The lizards belong in the light sitting still until they're ready to run. The crickets belong in the old stone wall and the bees belong in the clover, just as the winter belongs in the place after fall before the new year starts over. And you are a dream the world once dreamt, and now you are part of its song. That's why you're here in the place where you're meant, for this is right where you belong. The pines belong on the mountainside tucked under the blankets of snow, and the bears belong in the caves where they hide whenever the storm starts to blow. Some creatures were made for the land or the air, and others were made for the sea. Each creature is perfectly at home right there in the place they belong to be. No matter the places you travel to, what wonders you choose to see, I will always belong right here with you and you will always belong here with me. So right now, we're not able to be in one of the places we belong. We're not able to be at the middle school right now with our teachers and our classmates learning and laughing and having fun right now where we need to be is we need to be home 
but just because we're home and just because there's distance between us doesn't mean that we don't still belong to each other. It doesn't mean that you don't still have a home at Wall and Popeck, and it doesn't mean that you don't still have teachers that care for you deeply. So this is what I want you to remember. I want you to remember that we belong to each other. I want you to remember that if you need us, reach out, email us, call us, we're here for you. And I wanna remind you to do things this weekend to make yourself feel good, whether or not it's wearing a fuzzy sweater, whether or not it's hanging out with your dog, whether or not it's taking a break from some schoolwork and going outside and playing in the snow that fell last night, you do something for you this weekend to make yourself feel good and to make yourself feel happy. We at Wall and Paul Pack are so incredibly proud of you. We are so incredibly proud that you're doing the work you need to do to be safe, to be healthy, and to continue to learn. So wash your hands, be safe, be kind, and we get to start this all again next week.